Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Mint Math. And today, we're going to learn about differentiation, and we're going to apply the product rule. We're going to differentiate each function with respect to x. So if I was given this function, y equals, parentheses, negative 2, x to the 4th, minus 3, close parentheses, new parentheses, negative 2, x squared plus 1. Well, let's go label which one's my f and which one's my g. First one's f. The negative 2x to the 4th minus 3. And this second one, negative 2x squared plus 1, is my g. So now I'm going to apply the product rule. Product rule states, I'm going to take my dy dx here. Uh, the first part, f, negative 2x to the 4th minus 3, times the derivative of the second, derivative of g, is negative 4x, right? We don't need the plus 1. And that gets eliminated when we take the derivative of it. Then the 2 comes down and use the power rule. Plus the second, g, negative 2x squared plus 1, times the derivative of the first, take the derivative of the first, negative 8x to the third, and that's it. So now that we have our derivative, we've taken the derivative right here, okay? Um, so now we need to simplify that. So let's go simplify it. We do a lot of distribution, uh, distributions there. Um, so we multiply the negative 4x, so dy dx here. Multiply the negative 4x out, negative 4x times negative 2x to the 4th is a positive 8x to the 5th, uh, plus negative 4 times negative 3 is a positive 12, and then the x is there, plus distribute the negative 8x to the 3rd around, so negative 8x to the 3rd times negative 2x squared is positive 16x to the 5th, and multiply it again negative 8x to the 3rd by 1, and we have a negative 8x to the 3rd, okay? Now we look, do we, can we simplify anything and rearrange to have our highest degrees first? Highest degrees are our 5, so we can combine them, so our dy dx here. Well, 8x to the 5th plus 16x to the 5th, I would have to say is 24x to the 5th. Plus, well, or minus, next one's going to be the uh, 8x to the 3rd power, so we minus 8x to the 3rd power, and then the last term here is plus 12x, and there we go. We have all parts there. We have our derivative, which is 24x to the 5th, minus 8x to the 3rd, plus 12x. So let's recap. We're given our function here, y equals negative 2x to the 4th, minus 3, which is we call f, times negative 2x squared plus 1, which we call g. I apply the product rule, which was f times g prime, plus g times f prime, and then I simplify by distributing. All right, we'll grab that second part right there. Distributing out, leaving me with 8x to the 5th, plus 12x plus 16x to the fifth minus 8x to the third. I then simplify that a little more, um, uh, bring it and bring my highest degrees first, giving me my derivative, my final answer, dy dx, is equal to 24x to the fifth minus 8x to the third plus 12x.